set you up. I don't think she did this, man. Listen to me. I'm telling you the truth. Wednesday. Tamara is a whore. There's only one episode left. It didn't go well. Until the season finale. I need to ask you something. What? Do you know Fatima? And one epic showdown will have everyone talking. Karen's calling me. Really? My sister has a lot of questions for you. He's a married man. This is not going to be good. Tyler Perry's sisters. All new. The owner of my fears, my love. Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Pretty Summer, and I'm back with another sister trailer breakdown for episode 21. And as I can see, shit is about to hit the fan, and I'm ready to see what's gonna happen next. Before we get started, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification button so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. And to all my new visitors, please, please, please subscribe. My subscribers is going up, 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 up. And I'm like trying to get to a thousand before the end of the year. That will be amazing Christmas gift. So, yeah, you guys, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. And yeah, let's get into this recap. So, off rip, the trailer starts off with the drama. Gary is still at Aiden's place trying to convince him that um, Tamara is a whore. Gary says, she set you up, and you know, Aiden basically responded and said, um, I don't think she will do that. And Gary is really persistent. He's like, listen, man, she set you up. See, my thing is, I don't know if Gary is trying to be a friend to Aiden, or Gary is just trying to blow up his, Aiden's situation, or because his situation has blown up. Like, he don't want to see, he don't want Aiden to be right about his girl you know, about Tamara, you feel me? So that's why he went to go get all the information he can to sh prove to him that it's a setup, the love that he have for Tamara is not real. So at this point, Aiden is trying to convince, um, what's his fucking nigga name? Gary, that, you know, to, like Tamara is like not like that. And Gary's like, oh, she's a whore. The next scene, it goes to Fatima and Zach. Zach comes to the law office to meet with Fatima so they could both meet with the, the lawyer about Michael's case. The lawyer says straight up, things did not go well. So I'm guessing that, you know, all the stuff that Zach been through throughout his life, like going to jail mad times, like, I feel like they looked into that and was like, up oh, at the end of the day, like, the mother never been to jail and for fraud or whatever the case may be like um i think it's best he cuz he stays he stays with his mother cuz i feel like the the courts always rule for the mom even though in some cases the mom doesn't deserve it like this one then you see Zach and Fatima hug cuz you know Zach is like really really fucking upset like cuz he wants his son in his home but if you look in the background, you see Aiden walking up with the power walk. Like, Aiden is not fucking around. He's like, these two bitches is going down. And then it goes to Aiden asking Tamara, do she know Fatima? And you know what? If you would have seen her face or didn't know the story, you would have been like, she telling the truth. Like, this sweet young lady, no. There's no way she would have done that shit. Like, Nope. I feel like this whole episode, though, is going to be by Aiden. Like, once again, Tyler Perry's going to drag the fuck. Aiden's story is going to be long, long, long. Then it goes to Sabrina. She looks like she's at, like, an outdoor restaurant. I believe she's going to meet up with her manager from the bank to see if she's going to get her job back. So, hopefully that goes well for her. One, I don't know why Maurice is not there because I figured both of them will be trying to get their job back. But, hey, I guess we're going to have to watch and see. Then it goes to Maurice. And I don't know who Maurice is looking at, but whoever he's grilling, he's staring them down. And I honestly feel like Calvin probably told Maurice that Sabrina's going to meet with the his manager to go get, her, get his job back, get her job back. And Maurice is like, why the fuck they didn't call me? So he's staring at somebody. With the meanest grill. Maurice is clearly upset. And I really want to know why. 
Okay, now I'll go back to Sabrina. And Sabrina now, her face expression looks crazy. She looks so upset. She looks bothered. She looks so uncomfortable. She looks like whatever these people are telling her, she doesn't like it. Um, I'm guessing maybe the boss brought people with her to discuss Sabrina's situation at the job. Maybe she got demoted. Maybe they changed her whole location. I don't know, but the way Sabrina looks right now is not cool. She looks really, really upset, and I want to see why. This is weird. Now, now, here go Karen picking up her phone to call Zach. Why are you calling this man? First of all, you've been calling Fatima for the, the longest. Why stop now? Stop. Now, I feel like Karen have a plan. And I feel like Karen planned this to be the nicest person she could be, be kind, and all that good shit. So, Zach can let his guard down and not think about, like, getting the paternity test on her and the DNA test to find out if that baby is really his. I feel like she just trying to be so nice and, like, show him, like, hey, I'm over it. Like, I'm over the situation. I'm going to respect your girl. I'm going to respect you. Girl, a week ago, bitch, you were just asking me to fuck you, ho. I'm not... Why are you calling him? This, To be honest, I'm trying to figure out why in the world she be calling him right now. I'm like, it looks like she's still at that um, warehouse where she want the salon to be, where the um, Brian, the contractor, took her. So I'm like, what's she calling for? So he could go to check out the place for her? Like, girl, what you calling this man for? And of course, Zach being Zach and loving on Fatima so hard that we love it down. He tells her, like, yo, Karen's calling me. And Fatima says, really? Like, with the most, like, why type look. Like, why is she calling you again, girl? Why? Because in this point in a relationship, she don't need to call. Okay, so then it goes to Andy and Jordan. So it looks like... Andy decided to go on that lunch date with him, which I'm so happy about, right? Um, and he goes, my sister has a lot of questions for you. So I'm guessing like, hey, um, did you just want me on this date so you could convince me to talk to your sister? Because you could have just asked me on the phone like you did. And I said, no. So why are you asking me again? Okay, so Danny goes to Danny at the airport. She's at work, and she's on her phone, and she's like, he's married. So in my mind, all I'm thinking is like, who's married? Somebody got married? Who's married? Like, oh, my God. <laughs> who's married now? Like, what the fuck? So I don't know who could be married, but it could be Tony. He's, you know, he probably could be getting a divorce just like Jordan, because Jordan did tell Andy he would love to go on a date with her before he wanted to settle his, like, divorce first, and that's what he did, right? So now I'm like, okay, so who else could be married? The trailer then shows Sabrina on the phone, and she got up from the chair like shit just went down, and she's trying to get all the tea. I wonder what she heard. I wonder who she's talking to. Maybe she's talking to Danny, and maybe Danny's telling her that that person that she found out is married and Sabrina is shocked by it, like shocked by the information, but I guess we'll see. Okay. So then the trailer ends with Andy telling Fatima, this is not going to be good. Shit. Like it could be so many things Andy is talking about. One, it could be the custody battle. That's not going to be good. It could be Aiden finding out that, um, Fatima set Tamara, set Tamara on him. It could be so many things, but all I know is Fatima and Zach together, they, they're perfect. And I feel like they could beat whatever anybody throws at them. So long as they stick together, they could figure it out. Or it could be, it could be Penelope coming up to talk to Andy and Andy finding more information about Gary and expressing to Fatima, like, you know, what she told me is not going to end good or, like, this is not going to be good, whatever the case may be. It could be that also. So, I guess we got to wait till next week to find out. <laughs> okay, you guys, that was my trailer breakdown to Sisters, episode 21. This is 
coming down to an end and this was a great season so i'm so ready to see the last episode to see how tyler perry will end the season off i bet you next season when they come back karen is still gonna be two months pregnant oh my god you guys please comment what y'all think is gonna happen in this episode please comment y'all predictions and let me know what y'all think is gonna happen thank you so much for um commenting and liking the video and subscribing and sharing i really really appreciate it and i'll see y'all next week peace